Taboo Confession Lust for my hot sister What I am about to tell you is true. I am only writing it because after reading so many similar stories, I feel compelled to share my secrets. My oldest sister came home from college a different person than when she left for school. It had been a year already. When she left she was a skinny girl who never dressed in a way that attracted attention. I am three years younger than her. By the time she graduated high school and left for college, I was into girls, but never looked at her as a girl. She was just my big sister. The day she came home was a bit of a shock to me. My parents as well I think. She had on tight shorts and a flimsy top that made anyone who could see her notice that her tits were larger and she wasn't wearing a bra. When she got out of the car we were all standing in the front yard excited to see her. She jumped out of the driver's seat and ran to hug my mom. As she bound forward it was impossible to not notice her bouncing boobs. I remember feeling guilty for noticing this right off the bat. After hugging my parents it was my turn for an enthusiastic hug, she whipped around and grabbed me close, pulling me into her embrace. It seems silly saying it now, but as I look back, all I remember was seeing these braless boobs coming straight at me. The guilt was still there, but at my age even if it was my sister's boobs, having those beautiful pillows pressed against me was a dream come true. I remember being sent to get her bags from the car as my family all went inside. I was still thinking of boobs or something because now I only remember that I must have brought them in. That entire night we all talked and listened to her stories of college. We ate dinner at our old seating arrangements. Everyone in their place like we used to do every night. All through the meal I forced myself not to glance at her, but every time she got up for something, a drink, or whatever, I couldn't help it. It wasn't just her boobs that got bigger, it was her ass as well. She had gained some weight and was no longer the skinny girl she used to be. She had filled out perfectly in every way. That night after dinner she went to take a shower. My mom and I were watching TV. I remember listening to the show, but thinking wow. What's wrong with me? She is my sister, what am I doing looking at her that way? Of course I was imagining her all soapy and wet. The next couple of days went by with me trying not to let her see me sneaking peeks and acting like the good brother. I was getting her drinks, and being more of a servant to her than I should have. I couldn't help it. I just wanted to be close. Soon that first weekend came to an end with a pleasant surprise. It was Monday morning and my parents had gone to work. Brenda woke me up by pouncing on the bed saying get up lazy boy, we're going to the pier. When she landed on me, she landed straight on top of my morning wood. Instinctively I sat straight up and pushing her off a bit. She rolled off laughing saying hurry up, and as she leaned over getting up I could see straight down her top. She pulled her shirt closed saying hey. No peeking, you're my brother. As I look back now, I see that this minor exchange is what led to several weeks of the summer teasing game we started to play. She would catch me sneaking peeks and call me a perv but then ask if I liked what I saw. At some point I finally just said it out loud. Yes and I wish I could see more. She said you wish and called me a perv again. But soon after she provided me my wish. She would intentionally lean over so I could see her tits, or prance in a bathing suit so I could drool over her. We never did anything sexual but even to this day she calls me her favorite perv. The end. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.